Hello everyone. Let's provide the complete solution to this problem. B times B times B plus B equals 10. Now how do we deal with this problem? It's very simple. B times B times B will give us B to the power of 3 then we have B and this is equal to 10 now the next thing is taking 10 to the left so we have B to the power of 3 plus B minus 10 equals 0 because plus 10 to the left will give us minus 10 and this is what we have and then from here, let's um, break this into two so that we can easily factorize. This 10 can be written as 8 plus 2. So I write b to the power of 3 plus b minus 8 minus 2. This is equal to 0. Now, minus 8 minus 2 will still give us um, 10, minus 10, right? b to the power of 3 plus b minus 2 to the power of 3 minus 2 equals 0. So by now, if you look at these two, you discover that um, we have something similar. So we can combine this and this, and then pick this and this together. So we have b to the power of 3 um, minus 2 to the power of 3 then plus b minus 2 okay so we'll factorize this separately and then deal with this separately as we equate everything to zero but then do you know that x to the power of 3 minus y to the power of 3 this is going to be equal to x minus y into x squared plus xy plus y squared okay so we'll ex express this in this form so that um, our x minus y becomes b minus 2 right then in the next bracket x squared becomes b squared plus xy that will be 2b that is um b times 2 that will be 2b then plus y squared that will be 2 squared right then plus we still have b minus 2 here then we equate to 0 Let's take a step further, so we have b minus 2, then we have b squared plus 2b plus 4, then plus b minus 2 equals 0. By the way, what is common to these two is b minus 2. So b minus 2 will come out as a factor. And then here we have um, b squared plus 2b plus 4, right? Then plus b minus 2 divided by b minus 2 will give us 1. Then we equate to 0. b minus 2 is still a common factor. Then we have b squared plus 2b plus 5. If you open the bracket, then you can add 4 and 1. So we equate to 0. Now from here, we have two terms to multiply. And their product is giving us 0. So this means that either of them, or even both of them, must be equal to 0. So we can say that b minus 2 equals 0, or b squared plus 2b plus 5 equals 0. 
Now from here, our B is just 0 plus 2 and our B is 2. Here we have one of the solutions. But because we are going to solve this into detail, we will get the other solutions from here, whether real or complex. Now, what formula do we use for this? Okay, in the formula we are going to use, remember we are going to have B. So let me turn this to the equation so I get um, x squared plus 2x plus 5 equals 0. But mind you, whatever I get for x is for B. Okay? So the formula is x equals minus b plus or minus square root of b squared minus 4ac over 2a. Now we substitute directly into the, um, the formula. Our, our b is 2, a is 1, and c is 5. So x will be equal to minus 2 plus or minus, we have 2 squared, then minus 4 times 1 times our c is 5, right? So we divide this by 2 times 1. So to continue with this, we have x to be equal to minus 2 plus or minus square root of 4 minus 20 over 2. 2 squared is 4, 4 times 1 times 5 is 20, right? So we continue from here. x is now minus 2 plus or minus square root of negative 16. Then we divide by 2. This is because 4 minus 20 is negative 16. x is equal to minus 2 plus or minus square root of 16 times square root of negative 1. I just picked out the negative. So we divide this by 2. Now x is equal to minus 2 plus or minus square root of 4. Square root of 16 is 4. Then square root of negative 1 is i. But then we are dividing this by 2, right? So our x is equal to minus 2 over 2 plus or minus 4i over 2 but the 2 can go there and it can go here so x is equal to minus 1 plus or minus 2i meaning that x is equal to minus 1 plus 2i or minus 1 minus 2i so from here we have two more solutions but mind you that x is standing for b, so we have minus 1 plus 2i or minus 1 minus 2i. To get the three solutions, we got um, b to be equal to 2. This is our first solution. b2 is from here. We have minus 1 plus 2i. Then b3 is minus 1 minus 2i. This is the only real solution. This and this are complex solutions.